Welcome friends. In this video tutorial, we will learn about if else conditioning. In some situation, when we want to take decision based on some condition. In that type of situation, we can use if else conditioning. So, in this tutorial, we will learn and use if else statements. So, we have created one form which accepts marks of student. So, we will check grade for particular mark and we will write condition for that. So, let's click on the check button which will show the grade of the student based on the marks entered by the student in text box. So, let's generate the click event of check button. Now, we want to check condition for the marks. So, let's declare one variable. Let's store the value of text box into mark variable. Now, we want to give grade based on the condition. Now, let's use the if. Now, if we want to check that if mark is less than 35, then student is fail. So, so write if keyword, then mark variable less than sign and 35. Then, I want to display message box. So, write message box and in message box, show message that you are fail. Now, I want to I want to use else if conditioning. So, write else if. Now, I want to define second condition. Mark is greater than 35 and mark is less than 16. Then, message box, pass class, else if. Mark greater than 60 and less than 75. Then, first class. So, we have written condition which will show the grade class of student or grade of student. So, now let's run the application. Now, enter the mark. I am entering 20 and let's check the class. We can see message box is displayed. You are fail. Now, enter 74 which is a first class. So, this is the use of if else. We can check condition Based on the condition, we can take decision using the if-else. Thank you.